Hey everybody, it's Jojo and I'm here to do a Sturdy Soul Soap fragrance review. I got three fragrances. I got one mini in Sweet on Paris. I was really excited to try this one. And then I got two full size in Blue Raspberry Snow Cone and Banana Milk. So I got three fragrances. A lot of people were hyping about this brand, Dirty Soul Soap, Queen of the Girl Geeks. Lots of YouTubers were ranting and raving about them. I decided to give them a chance. Um, okay, so I have a lot of positive and negatives about this brand. Um, first and foremost, the shipping. Um, the shipping is horrendous. It takes the longest, and I get it. It's the only two people work, working in this brand. I totally get that. I just feel like waiting a month to, for anything is a very bad look on a brand. Honestly, on a business, it's a very bad look. Waiting a whole a month, it's it's not good. It's not good. I don't care how small the brand is. Um, it's it's not a good look um, at all. And I know people are gonna say, oh well, at least you got the products. You know, you know, at least you got them. You know, it doesn't matter how long it took you, at least you got them. I get that. I get that. And I get they're a small brands. I just am not gonna wait a month. So when I order something, I'm not gonna, I, I literally forgot I even ordered these. That's how long ago I ordered them, you know? And to be honest with you, I'm also not amazed by the products. Just jumping ahead here. So waiting a month for this we're not, was not even worth the wait. So um, I'm gonna be very blunt and honest about this video. So I guess I'll start with, um, so that's the one negative is, the first negative is the shipping. It is what it is. I'm probably never going to order from them again, um, to be quite honest with you, but the shipping was is a problem for me. The positive, I can say, is that I really do like the way they are repackaging old scents from Bath & Body Works. So they are duping Bath & Body Works scents. Like, that's what they're mostly doing here. Um, most of their, some of the, some of the stuff is new, but then a lot of the stuff is repackages and dupes of Bath and Body Works scents, um, which I really, really like. I think that's really good that they're doing that, especially like Sweet on Paris, right? This was a Bath and Body Works scent that came out years ago and they never done it again. So I was really happy to, to see this back in a mist form. Dirty So Soap is really repackaging really good scents and dupes from fragrances that, you know, we, we really loved and Bath & Body Works is just not doing that anymore. Blue Raspberry Snow Cone is a candle. I actually have the mini candle right here. Bath & Body Works has never made it in, in a fragrance mist or in a body care. Dirty So Soap has. So, you know what I mean? And banana fragrances. Bath & Body Works has never done a banana fragrance for body care and Dirty So Soap has. So, that's a really good positive I can say about the brand is that there really are, and they have hundreds of scents on that website. Fall, winter, Christmas, spring, summer, tons of different fragrances, tons of different Bath & Body Works dupes, fragrances that they, they've duped in candles and whatever made in fragrance medicine, body care form. So Dirty Soul Soap is definitely on the right path. I will say that. They're not quite there yet, but they're definitely on the right path. So I guess we'll start with the Sweet on Paris. I love the packaging too. That's another positive I can say about the brand. I love their packaging on stuff. I think it's really, really cute. I love it. Um, this is the mini. So this is um, fresh berries, warm vanilla, and fresh lemon zest of the keynotes. I don't remember the um, notes for the old. I remember smelling it. And I, remember, I do remember what it smelled like. I remember having it in body care. I just remember the fragrance now. So they say in the back of here, our versatile fragrance mist is perfect to use as a body mist or room spray. With a long lasting scent, you will want everything to smell amazing. Okay, so that is the background here. They say the ingredients is alcohol, witch hazel, palo bay fragrance, and gillison. I'm gonna bridges these, bridges these names. Made without Philophates, probins, and sulfates. Yeah. <laughs> Another positive I can say about this is that I love the mist. I love how it sprays. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's, yeah, you could. It sprays beautifully. Okay, so I have it here on my arm here. I sprayed on it earlier today. I can still smell it. <laughs> 
I don't like it. I don't like it at all. This does not smell like sweet on Paris. I remember what it smelled like. This is not it. This is not it. I don't like it. I'm getting this plastic smell with it. It's like a plastic, I don't even know. I'm getting like, like a tart, sour, plastic scent. It's not amusing. It's not, it's not good at all. This is my least favorite one out of, out of three scents I got. This is not good. And this is not smelling like sweet on Paris. I remember what it smelled like. This is not it. <sighs> I can't. I'm going to have to like literally wash my arms. I, I, I can't stand this. I'm going to try to see if I can return. I'm going to email them and see if I can return these scents. I can't. I can't. Especially this one. This one was a horrendous scent. Oh my God. I don't like that one. Sorry. I don't like it. I, I can't even smell it anymore. I'm sorry. It's just giving me a headache and it's making me want to throw up. Okay. So I guess I'll stop. I'll end it with a positive note. I'll end it with the one I do like. So this is the one, this is another one I don't like. So this is a banana milk. I was really hoping to like this one. This is keynotes of uh, bright bananas, creamy milk, and touch of vanilla. I was really wanting to like this because you guys know I really want Bath & Body Works to do a banana scented body care and they have not done it yet. And I really wanted to like this. This one is very light. The Sweet on Paris is actually very strong. This one's really light. I don't hate it. I don't hate it like Sweet on Paris. I will say I'm getting a banana candy, but the milk in it, I was hoping for a banana and like like banana and, and vanilla, like a banana and whipped cream type of thing, like banana spilled milkshake candle from Bath and Body Works. I was hoping for that. It doesn't smell like that. Um, it smells like banana candy, but the milk is turning the scent really weird and just like, it really is making it smell like sour milk on like a banana candy. It's really off-putting. It's really off-putting and I don't like it at all. <laughs> oh my God. This is why you should not blind buy st stuff online, especially scents, especially scents. <sighs> okay, so that is a pass for me. <laughs> this is not good at all. Okay, this is the one positive. The one I actually like is the Blue Raspberry Snow Cone. I actually really like this one. This is the one I won't return. So this is um, taut raspberry, chilled cherry, and shaped ice are the key notes. <clears throat> so I have it on here. This one's actually really good. I actually really like this one. Yeah, it's good. I do like this one. I have the candle. I'm currently burning the single wick candle. I think it's the same key notes, right? Blue raspberry, hints of cherry, scoop of shaped ice. It's the same, yeah, the same notes. Yeah, it's identical. It's identical. So this is the candle from Bath & Bioworks. It's identical to the, the fragrance mask. They did a really good job on this one. They did a really good job on this one. <laughs> now, is this like... I don't know. I do like it, yeah. I'm definitely getting the, um, the cherry and the raspberry. It's really nice. I do like this one. Yeah, this one's not bad. And again, I like the packaging on these uh, fragrance masks. I think the pack packaging is cute. I do like it. And it's kind of strong for a mist. Yeah. Okay, so... I feel really bad because I know this is an indie brand. I know that, um, you know, I want to support small businesses. Um, I know they're getting really big. Waiting a month to get these products, especially because I only ordered three missed, um, to get a month, uh, take a month to get these is horrendous. Okay, so that's number one. Number two, um, the scents are not up to par for me. They're really not, except for this one. These two are really bad. Like really, really bad. Like really bad. Like, I, I can't even, like, I, I, I can't even gift this to someone. It's that bad. Like, I have to return these. I hope they can, re I hope, I, they have to have a return policy for these masks. This one I do like. 
I it's not anything Bath and Body Works where they're anything really great. No, I would not say that. <laughs> it's it's okay. It definitely smells like the candle. I think the candle is a little better, honestly. I don't know. I'm not feeling it. I know Bonnie raves about these scents um, and everything, and I know a lot of other people have raved about them, as I was really excited to get these. I'm telling you guys this, being blunt, I'm being honest. You guys know I'm, I'm really good at detecting scents. I'm really good at explaining scents. I do not recommend this brand at all. The ones I got, I don't recommend. I'm sorry. The Blue Raspberry Snow Cone is the best, but it's still not up to par from what I really wanted the scent to be. So it is what it is. Um, oh my god. Oh. Okay, so this one's a, the worst. This is the worst I've smelled, I've ever smelled in my entire life. Oh my god, this sweet on Paris is horrendous. Oh my god, I need to wash my arms and hands. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, you guys, this is so bad. And to wait a month for this too was really cringe. I'm expecting a month, waiting a month for this. Oh my God, this is gonna blow me off the, the charts. This is gonna be so good. This is gonna be worth the wait. I'm not even gonna come on here and even complain about the shipping if this really was worth the wait. It wasn't, it definitely wasn't. Um, I'm very sorry to Dirty Soul Soap. I don't know if they would ever even watch this video or they're not, or they will, they're not. I don't even know, I, I don't know if they will stumble across this video, but um, I'm very sorry. I, I love supporting small businesses. This is just not for me. Okay, personally, this is not for me. This is my opinion, I guess you can say, because a lot of people do rave about these scents. My personal opinion is this is not a good brand. The ones I got, anyways, they have a million different scents. They could be scents that are good on the brand. I don't know. Unfortunately, they don't have a store, so I can't test and smell things. Um, you can only order this online. Um, yeah. Ugh. I'm really cringing hard, you guys. This is a really sad... Very sad, very sad reviews of these scents. Um, I really wanted to like them, I really, really did. Especially because, you know, especially a banana scent. And the, like, I was really excited for the banana one, honestly. It's so sad. And then this, I really wanted to, because I always wanted Beth and Barracks to bring the scent back. And so, I really thought it was gonna be, so I'm gonna have to return this. I might even return this one too, just 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 because you know at this point I don't. I honestly just just thinking ahead. I don't think I'm ever gonna wear this either, even though this is the best one. It's still nothing that I really like that much. Oh, you guys. I don't know. And this is supposed to be really good formula. I heard people really like it's really nice. It's a really good formula. It's supposed to be like moisturizing, not drying at all. It's very sad, very sad. You guys let me know down below if you've tried this brand, if you tried any of the scents, if you liked anything, you let me know, guys. I am very sad about it. Yeah, um, I'll never buy it again. And uh, I'm gonna definitely try to return these. I'm gonna have to email them right after I film this video and, and let them know that um, I want this, I want my money back. I want my money back, it's that simple. Okay, well, I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoy this video. I was hoping for a more positive video, a more positive outlook for these fragrances. I really wanted to like them, but unfortunately, that just isn't the case. Um, yeah. All right, well, I love you guys. See you in the next one. Bye.